Come, let me show y'all my Airbnb here in Ubud, Bali, Indonesia for one week. It's a three-bedroom, three-bathroom property. And I'm just renting one of the rooms. So this is the kitchen. It's a shared kitchen. But I like it. I like the vibe. I like the vibe. And it's open. Open concept. I pick good though. I pick I got some fresh coconut water on arrival. He picked it from the tree and I was like, okay, I see. But you. now let's go check out my room. Coconut, you know? This is my room. Hey. So this was my plan. Come rain or shine, whether I like it or Me not. Me and on in Bali for two months. I reached the point where all this hop, skip, and jump all around Asia was catching up to While me. While I was eternally grateful for the experiences, your girl is really a slow traveler. She's a pick a country for six months to a year and sit down and explore. The hopping around every few weeks was definitely me getting out of my comfort zone. But you see, my body and my wallet, they need a solid break, a solid rest, a solid pause from the gallivanting all over and this airbnb was the beginning of it all oh come check out my bathroom this is the toilet nothing fancy just getting the job done doing what a bathroom needs to do but i wanted to show y'all actually where the shower is because if you notice there was no shower in there and that's because the shower is outside outside shower yes man watch me can outside every day look your rain or shine i'm a for good in a daddy but anyway though it'll be cool you know when you see something online and you're like yes man this look good and then when you see it in person you're like what did i really decide to do to go outside and bathe every day but you know what? it's not bad look at these views it's gonna help distract me from anything that might cross my path while me shower in any event this, this room cost me 28 us dollars a night and if you know me you know that's a splurge so just know if you've ever sent me a little some some or feel like sending me a little something or something. purchase a guide from global gal or any merch these are the type of things that it goes to getting a roof over my head or paying for the flights to come and explore or the food to feed myself on these journeys i will be taking you all on some body adventures but they're definitely going to be a lot more chill a lot more calm this time is really for me to just catch myself catch up on all the content i have to share with y'all i still have stuff from sri lanka i still have stuff from vietnam to share with y'all build a routine get myself going you know get myself in a good mental space thank y'all as always for watching and you're gonna want to stay tuned for the next global girl adventures because we got some antiguans in the house hey